Uh, my name is Baraza Sundan. I'm the proprietor of this place. And uh, so we've had uh, a tenancy here for, for, we had a tenancy for five years. We leased the land and uh, constructed the structures with our own money, borrowed from loans, circles. Uh, we are still paying the loans in this place as we speak. But, um, this place was leased to us by one Charles Ariwi. Charles Ariwi is a brother to the owner of this land. And uh, the, so the brother apparently was abroad. So he came back later and we started discussing and he gave us uh, promises to renew our lease. He, last, he, he just changed his mind last minute and said he would not uh, renew the lease. We have to move out without any notice. So on, in February this year, he came and disconnected power. Immediately, two, three days later, sent in goons to attack the place and vandalize it. We went to court, the rent tribunal. They gave us stay orders. And um, so we have been um, going on this matter until today. So the ruling was made today, where, which you know, uniquely, purportedly gave these guys uh, back the land and asked us to go to another court that we, we, we are entitled to damages, but to another court. So we have filed an appeal under certificate of urgency that uh, this is going on. This expired in 2021, in September. We wrote a letter in July to intention to renew, because it was a close for renew. And they said we, they would renew. They promised that we have WhatsApp communication and everything, but they did not renew. Somehow, that they continued taking rent. Even now, they asked the court to pay rent for this month. So as we speak today, our rent is paid up to the end of this month. How much are you paying on a month? We were paying 35,000. So how much did you invest into this property? About 8 million shillings. But now together with the stock and the, the improvements and so on, it goes up to about 10 million. Initially it was 8. Mm -hmm. Have you been able to rescue anything today? I think these small plastic chairs and so on, but the main structures are going down, you can see with the bulldozer. How much loss would you say you have incurred today? Today I think it will go up to 12, 13 million shillings. We are paid rent, up to this month we paid through the court. They told us not to pay their brother who used to take the rent. They said we, we deposit in court, we have receipts showing we pay it in court. How did you find out about the court order? The court order, during the, the, the ruling today, the magistrate said, I'm not reading, it's a long order, but I've given these orders that you take back the land, that is following the preliminary objection. They had put in a preliminary objection. But they didn't file any real defense on this. And you know, I had sued, yes, we had sued four people. The owner of the land, the brother who leased us the land, the wife who receives the rent, and the Kenya Power who disconnected power without giving us any any notice. And the power had no bills, it is it's a prepaid meter. Yeah. Yes. The developer said also you have been here for seven years. But you're telling us you have been here for five years. No, no, it was five years in 2021 and then now it started running after mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. Which they have been taking rent and promising that they will renew. Of course, uh, we will just pursue this in the courts. Hopefully we get justice. Because clearly, I can tell you for free, um, they sent a court assessor here. Okay? Who then starts sending me messages, uh, you are going to be evicted. In fact, he sent me this message before final submissions.